So, this is going to be a painting con- or a photo contest. Now, what does that mean, you may be asking? Well, we have selected 32 people. Subs, friends of the stream, people who are loved by all. And we're going to give them admin powers on a server. The ability to spawn anything in. Uh, for the sake of taking a photo. Uh, to either tell a story, or just entertain the Twitch chat, to some extent. Uh, and you guys will be voting on who goes to the next round until we have a final winner. Uh, so it's gonna be a hoot. So prepare yourselves for that. Start flying around, go take your pictures! Go take your pictures! Go, go, go! It's time! Get out of here, man! Go! <laughs> I'll take the pictures in the world! Yeah, in the, you're take not the taking the, the pictures world. here! Oh, okay. Yeet! No, you gotta fly, oh, you're gonna die! Let me go! Where are we supposed to go? Where are we supposed to go? Down there, to do stuff. Man, I really didn't explain this well enough, huh? What's this guy doing? Maybe take a little peek? Oh, shit! <laughs> Man, he's got a whole setup going. That's awesome. Wow. I don't know what we got going on here, but I like it. Alright, well without further ado, let's start the let's start the thing. Um <laughs> Okay. So Lava, you're going up against Zadish. Yeah. Uh, he just threw up in, in his stomach. This is the familiar story of a bear called Nigel, who thought he'd try some survival. He found wood and stone to build his home, and on the search for scrap, he was caught in a trap and stopped playing boss because it's whack. Okay. Dude, you're going to the knockout round. Let's go. <laughs> uh oh. Let's go. <laughs> oh my. All right. Uh, all right. Did you take a seat right there? Okay. Anywhere. Let's see Let it. Let me tell you of a tale called a time to Venus. And finally, he had a rise to power, and he fell into the cocaine binge, <laughs> and OD'd and died. <laughs> there lots of cocaine. A time to Venus. A time to beat us, ladies Thank and gentlemen. Thank you, guys. Good work, man. Park, what's going on here? Hey. What's up? Hey, man, how are you? I'm doing great. <laughs> All right, so take a look. We got the Bush series, version one. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this is Spoon from Bush. Okay. By the way, guys, this is Bush, man. And this one here Stop, dude. is called Easter Bunny Man. And this one here is Man Run Fast. Okay. And then and this one here is <laughs> Man Takes Photo. All right, I like it, man. Good work. As Man does, Man decides to interrupt this beautiful symbiotic relationship that these two trees have. And, I mean, there's no reason not to use wood to create a house, right? This man cut those two trees who had such a tight connection with each other down to create a home to house his beautiful wife, who's expecting soon. <laughs> the sacrifice of the true trees has given life to a new member of the family. <laughs> okay. But there's a box down there. What's in that box? I want you to tell me. Is that Bradley in the box? What's in the box? What do you see? That is Bradley in the box. <laughs> the end. You are the Luke King. Bradley was in the box. That's that's crazy, man. That's really something the else. The whole time. All right, here we go. 
So, here we go. Uh, so, as you can see in the top left, just I'm just going to light this up for you so you can see it well, you know? Uh, you can see the scientist has initially tripped off of the top of launch site, you know, and, he, and he's starting to fall. And in this next photo, you can see... Alright, dude, the light is making it not further. even... I can't and, even you know, see it, so just... No, 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 trust me, you can, you can see okay. it. Okay, alright. I'm, I'm sure you can see it. Okay, uh, so in, ah. in this next... Alright, so this is the story of the bear's wipe, right? You know, he does some roaming, some PvP, you know, it does even a little bit of raiding, you know. Then, uh, you know, he, he gets AKs, dude. And then he gets raided, and then he gets really frustrated and angry, you know. Then he just takes a little walk. Okay. Alright, looks good, man. Yeah. yeah. And that's <laughs> Roger's life story. Alright, man, good work. When Gentleman 8 was doing a raid, a little toxic combat, obviously it was offline. God summoned a bear behind him to kill Gemini. And as you see here, the bear slowly killed Gemini until he was nothing but a pile of meat. This here is Gemini's child mourning over his death. But little did he know Gemini deserved this, all of what he got. Wow. But one thing I didn't tell you is. Jiminy was my father. Oh and my! And I am that poor child. I am so sorry. Anyway, how about you stop out of at the lovely memorabilia store where you can buy hat, glasses, and boots that I'm wearing right now for only a few pickles, and maybe you can play our lovely arcade game. Hey, hey. Thanks. No problem. Right, so we've got a p poor old lady getting shot by Bradley, and that's this scientist's wife. And because his wife got shot by Bradley, he decides to end it all, and he climbs up on the tower to the rocket and jumps off and falls all the way down. And here he is in the last moment. Man, that is really tragic. Okay, good stuff, man. He couldn't live without his wife. Now, I also tried to draw the Spoon Kid picture. Didn't work out well, and all my pictures are blurry. I have a picture of the gaming setup for the scientists, because you know they're on Rust fucking raiding people and shit. They're epic gamers, right? You can tell by the way they look. Then, you have the Bang Bus, right? right? Great great content from the okay found some dude in the shitter <laughs> that's pretty fun there's some spooky boy spooky boy big spook and then you can't see it well but it's a boar going for some cocaine you know <laughs> having a good old time this is toast okay and then uh, the next one is a picture of Toes. Okay. All right. And then the third one oh, yeah. is uh, a picture of the picture Toes. And then uh, the fifth one is a little bit different because it's a picture of the picture of the picture of Toes. Okay. And if you've been following along, this one. Is a picture of a picture of a picture of a picture of toes. And then if you look at this one, well, this is the last one. And it's you looking at the picture of the picture of the pictures of the pictures of toes. This is really some impressive work, man. Thank you. And then Lisa, sadly, brings her fall. And then, uh, bruh, sound effect number two. Bruh. 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 <laughs> and that's it. That's all I got. But then Jim calls. He needs some booty. They go to Jim's house. But it was a setup. It's actually Bradley. Bradley then traps them in his box and says,
sexually assaults them. If they sexually assault Bradley oh, back okay. and defeat him. They sexually now, assaulted you Bradley? The background of these photos, you might... Yeah, Bradley sexually assaulted them and then they sexually assaulted Bradley back. Gotcha. Okay, you were saying? If you look in the background, you might see you might see a little purple dot, which might involve the <gasps> next round. Might be bean. Oh my God! And right here, sitting top front row, is Ashley. Ashley was put in detention for unfair reasons, like going to the toilet when not asked, when not told to, and and you know, saying some bad words. Okay. Right. And here, Ashley answered the question wrong. It, it was a shocking moment. And Mr. Lucifer suddenly pulled out an AK-47 and told Ashley to get down on the ground. Ashley stood in shock as Mr. Lucifer pointed a gun at her. And then, on the CCTV, which was conveniently placed between these two people, was her two shots. Two fateful shots. That is all we have from the footage, but later, Ashley's dead body was found in Mr. Lucifer's house. This is terrible. Mr. Lucifer has been punished for his crimes, as you can see here. He was put nailed to a cross. Ashley's remains currently set in this box. It's tragic. Oh my god. I lost. Uh, the... The reason that she ha don't ask about the two skulls. This is terrible. This is awful. Thank you. Sorry to hear that, man. As Venus follows them home, sneaks. Finally, get into their house. Venus scares him. They turn around, and they, they already know what's about to happen. So they ask Venus to not this assault them. Hard. But he doesn't care. He's got them. And, you know, out of nowhere, he slurps them up, kills them. If we look very closely, yeah, we have a boom kid behind Venus, but he doesn't know. And that's a cliffhanger. What? For next what am I even... Okay, I think I, I think I get it. That's, uh... Bum. That's really something, man. Good work. Alright, hashtag 8 case Brown Flick hitting that triple dog. Let's see it. Oh, we got the evil bitch be like, yeah, I found a car, and then she's like, damn, these are car parts. And then they put the fucking parts in the car, and then, and then, boom, hit the dude, and then fucking hashtag BMC on Moose Kid, easy first wipe. Can you, can you run me through that again? I don't think I was keeping up with, <laughs> with how fast that went. Uh, sorry, dude, my brain's working on those fucking pristine parts or whatever, anyway. Like I said, from the top, you got evil bitch, right? Evil bitch finds car parts, more car parts, put the car parts in the car, into the straight into the dude, and then dude dead, hashtag boomed, Dion, Moose Kid, Fresh Wipe, easy, dominating. Wow. That is really something to behold. Okay, good work, guys. People want to say, Germany's bears. Germany got all the bears in the entire Rust world. And he oh. killed all of them. Oh, okay. Bears are now extinct. Over here <laughs> used to be the last bear. <laughs> it <laughs> seems to have been removed. Fuck. So that was. Then we got no bears left. <laughs> no, that's the last bear. They're all dead. Fuck. This okay. is this is Gemini's pedestal. All and right, then good. Gemini's message to God. It could work, man. A woman comes home after a day of work, slaving away day by day to see her man, her beloved, her fiancé of all people, to be cheating on her, someone who she doesn't like, even before this event. This lady cannot take this type of torment in life. She decides to end her man and this woman and as you can see it's a very gruesome end and uh, she decides to 
as she, I forgot to mention, she is a worker at the uh, launch site. She decides to climb up with her special permissions and fling herself off into her holy ground, her pride and joy, her workplace. And uh, she, she ends her own life doing what she loved. Now that's really something. And for Gemini's sin, they turned him back into a human. And some would say he is forever being tortured in God's chamber. Our surrounding us are his servants, so, you know, don't say anything about bad about God. Okay, I won't. Yeah, woo! Tutti? Hello. Let's see what you got. We have a sad tale about a man who's just doing his job. Two scientists, you know, trying to uh, clear out the satellite dish. They discover a contaminated object and on a, uh, on a daring adventure into the contaminated room, one of the scientists risks his life to identify the object. And uh, sadly, he gets extreme levels of radiation poisoning because he has a tear in his suit. And um, he develops cancer and dies at a young age of 37. But there's a happy ending. You can prevent people from dying from cancer. You just have to donate. Donate to cancer research. Donate to... Yeah. That's... Yeah. Um... Well, I appreciate you tying it into a positive there. That's really, uh... Woo! It's really something. If, if you just slash remove this, you see the true meaning of life. Wow. We take it for granted. You're right. Duty. You won, buddy. Yeah. Woo-hoo! Damn, Rod, I'm sorry, I man. It was really fantastic, and as you saw, it was close. It's okay. Hello? Hello? How you doing? Congratulations! I won! You won the event! <laughs> <laughs> That's funny, man. Uh, yeah, funny. It's rigged. Yeah, I guess so. Yep. <laughs> well, uh, you want to pick an item from my inventory? Sure, let's do some shopping really quickly. Uh, Alright, let me pull it up on stream. Alright. 